ladies and gentlemen, listen to me. A lot of you guys are like, oh my gosh, the narcissist hates me. Why do they hate me so much? Well, I'm here to tell you guys something. Do you know that the narcissist, it's not just you the narcissist hates. This is the reason why this hate is on such a pathological evil level. The narcissist hates your soul, okay? They hate your aura. They hate your existence. Just the thought of knowing that a person so amazing like you exists destroys them in the inside. Because the narcissist can't help but keep thinking about all of the good traits that you possess. Maybe you guys might be a good writer. Maybe you guys might be a good journalist. Maybe you guys have achieved a lot of accomplishments. Maybe you guys are nurses. Maybe you guys are just CNAs. Maybe you guys have good banking accounts. Maybe you guys are talented in or musicians or models. or Let me tell you something. The narcissist hates you. Everything about you. They watch every kind of movement that you make, ladies and gentlemen. You can tell because you can see the evil expressions when you do certain things. And you're like, damn, why did I experience that? You can just turn your head. You can be doing turning your head like so. And they hate that. They hate the way you turn your neck. They hate the way you walk. I'm going to tell you guys something. I witnessed my ex-narc. I was, We were downtown. We weren't at like an agreement. Now, mind you, you living in my fucking apartment. How you going to ignore me and act like I'm a piece of shit, but you're living in my shit? So, I'll never forget that we were walking downtown in my hometown. And... They were coming from one end and I was coming from the other, but we bypassed each other. And I will never forget watching them like just when they buy. I mean, we walked right past each other as if we were strangers in the street. I could feel the hatred, hatred and envy. But there was one part where I think there was an argument before that or maybe another time. And we were walking up and. We were arguing, but I was, we were crossing the street or something. And all I did was walk across the street. And as soon as I walked across the street, you should have seen the narcissist. All of a sudden, they were like. I look. Because they were like, they hated my walk. They felt like my walk was everything, ladies and gentlemen. You could tell the good qualities that you possess by the things that the narcissists hate that you ain't even focused on. You ain't never paid no attention, but they watching you, ladies and gentlemen, like a book. Let me tell y'all something. This person went to walking and stretch, and I'm just looking like, what in the hell kind of theatrics? The theatrics. It was so dramatic. It was like, what the fuck? They were walking and just move like, like I can walk. Too, and I can walk to, and I'm just looking like huh ladies and gentlemen <clears throat> I ain't gonna lie I always knew I had a sickening walk okay let's get that straight but that wasn't the main focal point whenever I'm walking to go to a different place I'm not thinking of that but sometimes it's like they're so calculating spiritually ladies and gentlemen they can calculate your thought and I I just remember Thinking in my head, in my own mind, in my own mind of me, I was crossing the street and I was walking. And I was, it was a walk that I was thinking in my head, like, you a bad bitch. Like, you a fly dude. You don't, you don't need, you don't have to be with them. And when I tell you, you should have seen the way they. I look. Okay. And they'll get so upset, ladies and gentlemen, when you are exhibiting your good traits. You could pause, you could be a good cook. And as you get ready to wrap up your meal, you
you getting ready to put that sauce on it like you normally do. And he go to Narcissus. You can be a good dresser. Like you maybe wear good attire, like nice clothes. And right when you get ready to button up that last button on that um long sleeve collar shirt, the narcissist. It's always that look of you thank you, you thank you, you thank you. And ladies and gentlemen, we don't even be thinking that in our head. That's why I say you can't win with these demons because you can't even downplay yourself for them to not be jealous of you. They're going to be jealous of you. Like, so how could you ever be with a person like that? How could you ever, like, you're just being yourself. A person hates you for being who, alive? That's why I always be telling you guys and then be encouraging you guys to get the hell away from them. Because, see, one thing, two things for sure. When I go out, I go by myself. Now, I'm not going to lie. I went out last night. And I seen and felt I was way too intoxicated to drive home. You know what I did? Slept right in my car. And I made a really good decision last night, and it worked in my favor. And I pray that I always make conscious, good decisions like that. I pray that I always do. But a lot of times, people rather risk going by themselves than being around a group of people. Because you just don't know who's there and who's not. Who's real? Who's not? Oh, she's real. But he's not. If you really, you know it, clap your hands. Hey, hey, everybody put claps. Put, 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 put real in the comments. I'm real. Put, I'm real in the comments. Let them know a real one, ladies and gentlemen. I'm watching my bearded dragon look at me. Because he already ready to rain havoc. And you going to want me to take me out, take him out of the aquarium. Her, I think she's a girl. She gonna want me to take her out of the aquarium in a few. She always sitting back and watching me talk. <laughs> you guys, my beardy is something else, I swear. She be sitting back watching me talk. <clears throat> she just turned over here and looked like, what you talking about now? But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, yes. The way the narcissist is so in tune with your thoughts and ambition is the same way that when you talk to an animal, it seems like the animal can almost understand you. That's almost how it is, ladies and gentlemen. This, narcissists are not psychics. Okay, let's get that straight. They are not psychics. They're just very intuitive in a manipulative way. It's only for manipulation benefits. You get what I'm saying? Like, you know, they're not going to use their intuition to get them away from danger or to make better decisions to excel in life they're going to use their manipulation to see okay well who is that over there okay well if i talk to this person that person do this and that that's the, their mindset i'll see you guys in more videos i just wanted to drop that off to you guys this morning you know i give them to you as they come i love you guys and i will see you y'all have a good day and don't let the narc stress you we got this